What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kat and this is my channel. Today I'm going to be doing, as the title says of this video, a try-on swimsuit haul featuring Old Navy and American Eagle. Um, so for those wondering, my sizes, my measurements are going to be in the description box below. I am what I consider an in-betweener size, so depending on the store I can be anything from a size 10 to a size 16. Um, so all of the items that I purchased are actually from the straight size section in both stores, just so you're aware. I'm still going through my weight loss journey. My body isn't obviously 100% the way I would like it to be, but I really wanted to make this video for you guys, um, mostly because half the Old Navy stuff is going back and I needed to make this video. Uh, but just be gentle. I have never shown myself in a full swimsuit, I don't believe, on my channel. Even when we've gone to Florida, I don't know if I have. There was like one underwater shot from Captiva last year of me like swimming by that I got on the GoPro. But other than that, I'm not sure I've really done like a full body. And I have two one piece suits in this video where I show you my whole body. So um, this took a little bit of bravery for me, but I'm trying to love myself and let it go. Just, this is who I am, this is what I got, and I know a lot of people out there look just like me and have similar body concerns and things they'd like to improve. So uh, for those of you that are also on your weight loss journeys, keep going, we will get there together. So that being said, let's jump into the video. So originally I picked up these suits on uh, Memorial Day from both of these websites. So I ordered on Memorial Day for the Memorial Day sale. Um, we are going to Florida at the end of July and for some reason I feel the need to have a different bikini for every single day. That's just what I want in my life right now. So um, I jumped on Old Navy because all of the swimsuits were literally half off. Were, oh my God, between 10 and $12. 10 and 12.50, somewhere in there. So none of these were expensive. And I did only get tops from Old Navy, just so you're aware. So let's get into those. I'm only keeping one as of right now. I'm not sure, this very first one I'm gonna show you, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it or not. I just can't decide. So it is what they call their bralette top. So it's in this really cute floral pattern. It is a bralette style. Um, my problem is I got, I think all of these in an extra large and yes. This one is just a hint too big. Uh, I don't know. I just, I can't decide with this one. Like, I like how it looks, and I think this one was only $10. But, um, it doesn't have the actual price tag on it. But, it's really comfortable, but it feels loose in the band. Now, I mean, when I tried it on, the thing keeps slipping, so it, look, it might look like it's stretched to the max, but legitimately, I probably could take, like, two inches off the fabric and it wouldn't matter. Um, I can't, I just can't decide. Let me know what you guys think about how this looks on me because I just literally cannot decide if I want to keep it or not. So the next one is this orange bikini and it is the halter underwire bikini. So as you can see, it is like a bikini with uh, an underwire bra cup, which is really great for those of us that are larger chested. Um, this did fit me not well. This is probably the least fitting least well fitting of all of them um, and you can kind of see it in the try on portion I tried to go to the side so you could see where it was too large on my chest um, but it's literally just like this part too big don't know why all right sorry if the angle is a little bit different my camera just tied on me right in the middle of this um, but I like the color and I kind of like how it looks but I also think that it it almost makes my boobs look even larger which I don't particularly love all the time which uh, you're gonna see in the next clip because it just oh my god Ugh. but um so my measurements are down below you can see what my bust size and what my band size are so you can tell if you're larger or smaller than me if an extra large would fit you but this was just too big which was really surprising to me because I got extra larges in literally everything and the next suit that I'm going to show you was too small so um it's this cute little gingham string bikini and it fits in the string areas just fine but I think the cups are just too small I mean you guys can see I've got like some under boob kind of going on and Brett doesn't mind that but I'm worried that a wave's gonna hit me and everything's just gonna 
come out. <laughs> and that's not what I want. I do think it's really cute, um, but I just, I, uh, it just doesn't fit well enough for me to want to keep it. So it's 100% going back. Um, I wonder if I'd gotten it in the next size up if it would have been okay, but I just didn't like how it looked on me enough to even mess with getting it the next size up, to be totally honest. So, okay, so the last suit from Old Navy is my absolute favorite. It's one of my favorites um, of the suits that I'm gonna take in general, oh, just like, <laughs> in general for this trip. Um, so I have had quite a few like wrap bikinis from Victoria's Secret here and there. I think I even wore one in my original Florida vacation when we went to Destin two years ago. I think I even have one then. Um, but they just never fit right from Victoria's Secret. The cups are just never big enough. And I just have such a problem with pink. I am not gonna buy any pink swimwear this year. Um, and it's literally because I just know it's not gonna fit right. And it's really sad because I love their stuff, but I just can't do it. I'm not gonna shell out all those dollars for that. So. This one, I'm just gonna, just gonna hold it like this because you can't tell what it looks like until you see the try-on portion. But you can see the print and what you can see that you need to see before you see the try-on part, it literally is a bra. Like underneath, it's a bra. This is an extra large, it fits perfectly. This will fit a double D perfectly, I guarantee you. So it does have the strap that just goes over your head, so it's kind of like a halter, but what's really cool is that the strap that goes over your head is adjustable, which is spectacular. It makes me so happy because um, I was able to shorten it. I needed to, which is wonderful. So then this, so it hooks in the back with your regular hooky do, and then the straps come across the front, and then you tie that in the back, as you guys can see in the try on portion. So I love that. That is one of my favorite things. Um, if you've been paying attention to my Instagram, you can tell that palm leaves are one of my favorite trends happening this year. I am all about the palm leaves. So uh, thrilled beyond belief that that fit um, and that it only cost me like $12. I just wish they had bottoms that matched that were high-waisted because I didn't see any and I'm kind of sad about it. So, Speaking of palm leaves, because I have a problem, um, American Eagle, I bought all two larges and one extra large. So the first top is palm leafed again, um, except this is pink and green. It's kind of hard to see the coloring, but um, the leaves are a little bit more realistic looking on this one too. Uh, but I really like this. So this one isn't an extra large. It does have removable cups, which I will most likely remove. Um, it's a really comfortable kind of sporty top that I really like. It's so soft. I can't even explain to you how soft this is. It doesn't even feel like swimsuit material. I don't even understand. It feels like that modal material that I love so much. This is from Airy. Let me see if it says what the material is. This is the scoop style, apparently. I just saw that on the tag. Here we go. Oh my god. Nylon, elastane, and polyester. Okay, whatever. Either way, it's really soft. Um, I have a tiny bit of underboo with this, but it doesn't bother me as much. And the straps are just a smidge too long. But honestly, I really don't care. I like it. I don't remember what that one cost. All of these were less than $20 from American Eagle. So um, I haven't owned a one piece swimsuit in a long time. I have to turn these back right side out because I just tried them on for you. Um, they have the original price tags on them. Let's look at that real quick. This one was originally $30. I think I paid half of that for this, or maybe $20, maybe. Um, but I don't think so. So I got this cutout one piece, which I am in love with. I think it is so cool, it's so different. Um, it has the high-waisted bottom style. I love the cutouts, I love the halter neck. This print is so cool and different. Um, this is in a size large and it fits me so well. Like, I'm so happy with it. I'm so happy with how this fits. It's comfortable. Um, it might be just a smidgen small in the boobage region, but I am okay with that. So I highly recommend stepping outside of your comfort zone and trying something like this if you've been nervous about trying on um, 
one piece suits with cutouts i was kind of nervous about it um but i really 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 like it i think it looks really good on me um and i know i'm gonna be really comfortable i might wear that on the day we do jet skis or water sports of some sort um and that is the reason why i got this other suit so i just wanted a, a black swimsuit that didn't have the scoop because i always know that when they do that with the scoop the the straps are gonna slide off and then my boobs are gonna fall out and it's just not gonna be it's just not what i want so i picked up this one um that has the thin straps and the strappy back and i also thought if i was tanning on the beach on the front like you know like on my back um that it wouldn't leave a crazy tan line on me and i know the back has a lot of strappy doodads and such but i wear so many other suits that i could fix that tan line in that i think it's gonna be okay so that is what i have for you guys today i hope you enjoy this video let me know what your favorite suit was in the comments below let me know where you think i should try to get swimsuits from i probably need maybe a couple more before we go to florida i haven't like a thousand percent decided on which ones i'm taking i'm definitely taking the black one the one the other one piece the multicolor one piece and the two palms and then i don't know what else i'm taking yet so um i'll probably take my tried and true torrid um bandeau top that's the one i always wear on the last day of vacation because then it fixes all the tan lines so that's a little tip there for you guys but um let me know in the comments below subscribe if you haven't already become a member of my warrior crew if you have thank you i love you uh be sure to click the bell notification so you don't miss any videos i put them out on mondays and fridays at, i almost said 5 p.m <laughs> at noon central time and i will catch you in the next one love you warrior crew bye